Welcome to Allergic Stadium, home of the Lost Wages Invaders. And Briggs, last time I was here, I lost my shirt at the casino. What, any bad? I lost three fingers in my one good toe. I should have seen it coming, no grin. I was in a whole five Gs, and uh, the loan shark was a real shark. Yeah, well, that's a tough break. That was my favorite shirt, too. This game is going to be a wholesale slaughter. No discounts in the NFL. The team stormed the field. The Carcass City Creeps take on the Lost Wages Invaders. Welcome to NFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. It's game day here on the MFL Network, and we are just about to get underway. Hi, everyone. Grim Blitzrow, along with Brickhead Mulligan. Hi. Any thoughts on today's game? Uh, uh, hmm. and, uh, no, not really. Kind of flatlining right now in the thoughts department. Uh, hey, can you help me get out of my ear? Uh, worse than it was the last time. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot three. And the ground game is starting to soften up the defense. First down. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, eight. Second down and more than the QB would like. Oh, a great catch, and he picks up a new set of downs. And it's first and ten. Oh, man, he really wants it. And he's able to grab that one somehow and hold on for the first down. This guy set of hands, Grim. It's the third set of hands he's had so long today. Looks like it's a good fit. Hey. Nicely done. Picks up three on that pass play. Ooh la la. Second down and seven. Hot one. Hot two. Hot he might have managed to dig out a yard on that one. Not my yard. Got too much buried in, you know, the usual money, bodies, coffee cans filled with, well, uh, you know, mostly coffee. Tastes better, like Eskimos burying salmon heads, kimchi. How oh, many anything really tastes good? I just may be in commentary, but I thought you were supposed to throw the ball forward. Uh, yeah, 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 you're right. You should. The drive was stalled, and here comes the field goal attempt. right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. They need a good return here to set up the offense. Looks like he'll be able to run this one back if he's not terrified for his life. He is, but he's got no choice. And it's first and ten. It's a six-yard gain. And that'll be second down and four. And the defense puts one over on the quarterback with a sticky ball dirty trick. The only thing the QB can do now is run for his life or die. Third down and eight. Caught for the first down. And 
And it's first and ten. Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. Second down and ten. Chains. That's good for a first down. This game is all about momentum and killing. First and eight to go. A pickup of about three on that play. And that'll be second down and four. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot three. Touchdown! Oh, he ran through those defenders like a greased turkey. Don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. He's going to be able to run this one back. I wonder if the kicker was setting up an easy kill. First and ten. Look out, that's an all-out attack on the Q. And the whistle blows the play dead, along with the quarterback. And it's first and ten. Defense gives up five yards on that pass play. Second down and five. I'm going to say maybe three yards, but a tough three yards. It's anyone's game still at this point. I know, which makes it so hard to place a bat. And that'll bring up third and one. Well, that'll trim your nostril hairs once and for all. And it's first and ten.
And here comes the extra point attempt. Straight through the uprights. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. And it's first and ten. says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. And that ref is dead. You know, maybe they should consider hiring blind refs and make it safer for them. If they can't see the play, they can't blow the whistle. And if they don't blow the whistle, they don't die. Can't argue with that logic. Third down and forever. the way you do it. Eat up chunks of yards with pinpoint passing. Don't do anything stupid here. Just punt the damn ball and play defense. And he put all of his foot into that one. And he's got a chance for a good return here. First and ten. I hear a lot of guys talk about stepping up their game, Bricks. He just stepped up and blew up. <laughs> He's got a lot of guts, doesn't he? And you can see the grounds crew cleaning him up now. Hot potato gets him every time. And it's first and ten.
third down and never going to happen. With kickers, you never know. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. First and ten. And the ball razors through the defense, cutting a defender in half. But that means he can wrap up the other half and save it for later. And he reels that one in for a first down to keep the drive alive. <laughs> Two minutes. The chess game has begun. It's like chess only. You can kill people. Second down and nine. Hot. Hot. Why? Man, what a hit that was. Well, that's two timeouts burned. And you have to wonder, Bricks, are they desperate or are they in control? Yeah, I'm speaking from experience, Quinn. But it really is hard to do both at the same time. And I have mastered it. If you don't think you can make the interception, batting it down is the next best thing. Great advice, Grim. That receiver's gonna go far in this league if he listens to you. I wasn't talking to... Yeah, never mind. Yes, Brick, he will. Hey. Well, wow, surprise me. He made it look easy and he gets three points for it. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't a broad in my bed. It was a chick wearing a wig. <laughs> and it's first and ten. the ball into the defense picking up seven under two minutes a timeout means the QB is playing beat the clock and he better win second and three and that is caught for a first down And the offense quickly calls their second timeout. That's how you do it. Do what? When in a hurry up offense, the offense needs to run out of bounds or take a timeout to stop the clock. And the quarterback drills one in for the first down. First and eight to go. And that's it. That's the last timeout. It's score or die from here out. The offense goes into their two-minute drill. What the hell is that? It's the same thing as a hurry-up offense, you moron. I am... That was a good throw, and assuming he was aiming for the ground. And the quarterback signals for a hurry-up offense. Hey, Grim, what's the hurry-up offense? There's no huddle. 
called. The offense calls plays at the line of scrimmage. And he zips that one in there for a touchdown. Hey, man, nobody can touch me when I ball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. Hey, what you talking about, pilot? And these guys think kicking is for pussies, Bricks. They're going for two. Yeah, they got big balls, Grim. Yeah, bigger than yours. And they run it in for two points. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. And the quarterback goes into a hurry-up offense and calls all the plays from the line of scrimmage from here on out. We know this quarterback likes to play with soft balls, but the defense, they're playing with big balls and just crushed his balls. That's a lot of balls, man. <laughs> Second, the quarterback just used his final timeout. Let's see what they come up with on the next play. Second down and more than the QB would like. He had it for a second there. And that's the end of the second quarter. Someone will need to pull together some bribe money as they head to their lockers. Stay with us for the halftime show, brought to you by our friends at Monsatan Industries. We make genetically altered Franken food you'll have fun trying to identify. We are back for the second half as the teams line up for the kickoff. The coach told his players they'll be strung up on the goalposts if they don't make this a game in the second half. That's how you motivate these pricks. <laughs> They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck off. That was just a one-time thing. with the punishing hit. And it's first and ten. Ouch! What is this, 80s wrestling? And it's first and ten. And he picks up eight yards on a strong run. Second down and two. And he just slipped away. Oh, wow, sure, now he catches it. I had this guy on my fantasy team last week. I lost so much money on him, not to mention my kneecaps. My loan shark is very anal about collecting my money on time, Graham. <laughs> jumps off sides to kill the ref. They say, we're mad as hell and not going to take it anymore. First down in a mile. Hot, hot one, 
for maybe a yard. They've got to open up the offense here, Bricks. Second down and ain't gonna happen, partner. One, hot two, hot, hot. on that play. They caught the defense napping. I'd be impressed if he splits the uprights from this far away, Bricks. If he doesn't, they're going to split his skull wide open. It's good. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. Shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> it's good. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. First and ten. That's a nice gain of about seven yards on that run. Second and three. Oh, mama! He just knocked him into the next time zone. Once he finds his head, he'll be okay. And it's first and ten. Nice pass. That catch is good for six yards. And that'll be second down and four. You know, sometimes the best thing to do is just punt and let your defense get the ball back. He boomed that one. Let's see if they can get a nice catch. And it's 
Turns on the afterburners. Pump. If there were any functioning brain cells before that hit, they're gone now. He's going to have the IQ of a rutabaga after that hit. And it's first and ten. And the defense jumps offside. Now the QB has to try to run out of bounds before they get to him. Needless to say, it was seven crazed defenders coming after him. And that's not easy. Ah, the old quarterback shellac play. The offense is running low on quarterbacks. They have only two left. They might consider running the ball more. And it's first and ten. Oh, man, he just laid the wood on that guy. Yeah, if you're going to hit a guy that hard, you should at least kill him. Do him a favor. Finish him. Second down and six. I've seen this guy run through a brick wall. He loves bang. First down. First and ten. And he finds open spaces running toward the end zone. Turn on your jets, you son of a bitch. And it's first and ten. Scrambled, he'll be thinking about that hit. Yeah, most likely in a convalescent home. The third quarter has ended, and we'll need a huge rally or a high death toll to make this one interesting. Second down, the size of Bricks Wiener. Hey! Sorry, partner. they have to forfeit. Well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. Straight through the uprights. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. goes into a hurry up to pick up the pace of the game. Second down in a lot. Third down and well, good luck. These guys have metal balls. They're going to try to pick up the first down here. Did they check? And that was a bone crusher right there, folks. And it's first and ten. up the first down.
great throw, great catch, and then put six points on the board. The defense could do anything to stop a thrown out good, man. You mean aside from bribing the ref, killing the quarterback, or actually playing some D? Don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. wants to speed things up, so it signals a hurry up. That same as Prince's ex-girlfriend signaled when they were doing it. Yeah, she called it rabbit sex. I took it as a compliment. If that hit didn't cripple him, it certainly left skid marks. And it's first and ten. Right. And then it's a first down from a great catch. Was it a catch, though? Let's consult at least 72 pages of rules to figure it out. And it's first and ten. Oh, and did he just put on a display there? Touchdown! Some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called center. The kick is good! As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. Looks like they're lined up for an onside kick. Uh, I thought they were going to do some sort of chorus line. First and ten. And he pounds the ball into the defense, picking up seven. Second and three. Oh, and that one's going to hurt. He may not be able to comprehend math after that hit. What's math? Exactly. First and four. He runs it for three. And that'll bring up second and one. Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double-stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. They need a good return here to set up the offense. They're going to be able to return this one. First and ten. Get your motor running. It's chainsaw time. He's at the twenty. 
They're getting on him. Hey, come on, move your ass. I got a saw buck riding on this asshole. Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. It's good. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five. And then will bring us to the two-minute warning. It's do or die now. And it's first and ten. He refuses to go down. First down. Either the defense is trying to keep some time on the clock for their offense, or someone let a real bonehead touch the controller. And it's first and ten. That's a killer. It was right there, and then he dropped it. Ah, oh, scumbag is killing me in fantasy league. Second down and ten. when it feels like to have your teeth removed without Novocaine. If I had all my teeth knocked out like that... And the D takes their second time out, hoping for a miracle. I witnessed a miracle once. A player was brought back from the dead. That's not a miracle, partner. That's just how the MFL works. And that's a great nine-yard completion there. Hey, it ain't great if you don't score or move the chains. No more timeouts for the D. Or the offense, Bricks. That's that's the important part. And that'll bring up second and one. He hit that line the way a Republican congressman hits the airport men's room. Good and hard. First down. And it's first and ten. Don't you just love the sound of bones snapping and cracking? I mean, when you're not yawn. Second down and six. He dropped it. If he does that again, they'll drop him. Third down and six. And a hard run there picks up the first down. And kickers practice for this kind of kick every day. Pretty the invaders suffer a devastating defeat and lose at home. And I bet on these losers. I'm down two J's. Hi, Junior, you need to stop gambling. I can stop. How much you want to bet? They've got 99 problems, but a winning one of them. That's right, Grim. Just like a bridge over troubled water. Like a whole lot of Rosie. The game's most valuable player is speaking about the victory now. <laughs> Grim Blitzrow with Brick and Mulligan and Bricks Jr. and all the folks at Evil SN want to thank you for watching this presentation of the Mutant Football League. Today's final game stats are brought to you by the Microhard Corporation. They get it right every other...